already used to having her hands pause, uh, just touched. So what we're going to start doing now for her is just applying a little bit of pressure to her paws. So I'm gently squeezing her paws, the front ones, while she's eating some cheese. And then <clears throat> we're going to take it to where I squeeze the paw gently, and then I get rid of the cheese because eventually we're gonna to have to clip the nails and then hand them a piece of food. So we take the cheese away. This is when you can start playing with their toes if they'll let you, and then you give them a piece of cheese. And she's so easy peasy. You don't care, do you? There you go. A little playing with the feet. And she's just like, I will take that cheese. And we're gonna do the back paws too. And if they're on your lap like this, I've got my right arm sort of cradling her in case she decides to jump. So I can go behind her and be sure she's not going anywhere. So we've got handling and then cheese. And how old is she again? 11 weeks. 11 weeks old. And this is, I mean, really the best time to start this process because especially with a dog like her, with little Maggie here, she, the easier it is for her to be at a groomer, <laughs> the less traumatic it is for everybody. 